Hey everyone, we're here with today's item shop video. And it's a whole vaulted shop. So basically it means it's been vaulted for a year or more as it says on top. So all these skins are extremely rare. And they're cosmetics of course. So we're starting off here with the Fortnite Classics back bling. So we got the Rocky back bling, the chair back bling, the tube top back bling which is reactive to damage. And the Nomax. So if you guys don't know what this is about, it's basically like, you know, like chapter one reminiscence. You know, all this should mean something to somebody. If you were in those seasons, then, then it does. But uh, still pretty great. You could use it with a lot of skins. Star Flare with the Universal Bloom. I don't know if she's rare. I feel... I know we've seen the blue version. I feel like she's been out, though, within this year. I don't think she's been a year or more, but maybe just do it in so it fool somebody. Uh, let me fix the camera here. I just realized you guys could barely... You guys could barely see this. Give me a second. God, this tripod wants to give me trouble today. Uh, let's see if we move this back a little bit. All right, there we go. I really need to buy a total tripod for you guys. We have Twisty with the Twisty Inflator. So I have the male version of this skin. I don't remember the name of them. But uh, these are not these are not that bad of skins. I know a lot of people probably don't like it, but it's it's kind of like a meme type skin, and I think it's fun. We have Bigfoot with the cooler back bling. Uh, not gonna question why uh, there's a fish stick arm in there. But uh, we're, we're just gonna go along with it. You know, no, nobody has questions for that. We have the Wave Ripper with the Tidal Hazard back bling. Not a bad skin, it reminds me of what they did with the FNCS skin. Kinda reminds me of that. So you can have a style, apparently his mask comes off. So not bad, green and black, another Xbox type color thing. You guys probably were gonna expect me to say that. With the Trihook pickaxe this one's very unique i like the way this looks very very nice oh my god wow this is this is packed we have pickin this one's a fun little emote go with the wild west skins we got flipping incredible Automatically, I can tell that goes in Meowsos, because that would be great for him. The Flux Flyer. So, this actually goes to the skin they had a while back. They brought back him and his pig ass. I don't think they brought back the glider. So, that's good if you guys have that skin. We got Bobbin. Widow's Web Animated. That's cool. That can go with the Spider-Man stuff. That's 100% worth it. We have Glyphic. Hula. That's kind of good for right now because now it's kind of relaxing of a season. Unreal Chill. Not sure when this came. I'm surprised I didn't get it. 200 V-Bucks? Maybe I missed out on it. You guys could barely hear it. It's like a small beat. We have Clockwork. Oh, man. I feel like I remember this, but I feel like I don't. It's kind of like one of those raps. That's what I'm actually great with, like a Midas skin or something like that. We have White Dragon. Wow, all these gun raps are very surprising to me. They honestly look pretty good. I mean, this one you could barely see. You can see kind of on this side better. But not bad. And I think that ends the Voltage Shop. But if you guys don't know this, um, they did this last year where they had the Medic skins come back. I know those were a big thing. But not bad. Pretty great skins and cosmetics as well. Depends if you really like them or not. We have the Street Shadows Bundle, another ruby with the Blackout Bag. The Shadow Slicer. And the Sky Shadow Glider. Not bad at all. 
We have dark Tricera Ops with the dark hatchling, and they each get a darker style. Nice little purple. Dark Rex with the dark scaly, and these also get a dark purple style. Dark Dino Bones. The Peekaboo with the Battle Balloon. I really like this backling. Night Knight with the Balloon Llama. I didn't even show you guys through the different styles they have. The male definitely looks like a Pennywise more than the female. So I'll let the female scroll through. Because this one I can't just show you automatically. But uh, very cool. I like that they got extra styles. You get the Pick Squeak. Definitely a pricey pickaxe. We have Fate with the Ominous Orb. Not a bad skin. I feel like you could really run this if you don't want to be too flashy. Omen with the Battle Shroud. Uh, apparently it says the outfit in the locker cannot use a cape backlist. So I guess you can't use like, stuff over the cape? Or does it mean you can't use two capes? Uh, you guys probably know better than me. We have the Faded Frame. The Oracle Axe. The Split Wing. Sizzle Sergeant. Grill Sergeant. Sizzlin. This is a fun little emo. I'm telling you, SpongeBob or, or any kind of cosmetic from SpongeBob comes to the game. This stuff will be go good with it. Hmm. Well, I, I feel like the the daily shop is made to be a rare thing too. Because we're starting off with Maximilian. We got Grit. Not a bad camo-ish type skin. Team Burger. Team Tomato. So I hope everybody got those. Because for 100, there's no excuses. Double Gold Pickaxe. And Lock It Up. So might as well put that in your collection since it's 200. We have the Street Fighter stuff. Still only one row. I don't know. Some people said there was a new Street Fighter game. So maybe that's why it came out. The Naruto stuff is still here. Old and new. Uh, I did finally finish the Nindo challenges. So, some, some people I know didn't want to get it free, but I tried it, and I eventually got it. We have Spider-Man Zero still here, Levels, and the crew. So, definitely not a bad shop. Definitely worth it if you want to collect some stuff. So, today's your day. I don't know if it's going to continue tomorrow, too, but take advantage. Other than that, I shall see you guys tomorrow.